video, I'm going to show you six ways that you can reposition your asset to attract high quality tenants. One of the biggest roadblocks to attracting new tenants is the quality and design of the existing building foyer. Many building owners are underutilizing the space that they have available and fail to see the opportunities to improve their asset. Here are a few things that you can do to keep your building relevant and attractive to new retailers. As an owner, it's really important for you to keep your tenants in your building and to keep them happy. We're finding in the market at the moment that a lot of uh, tenants are coming to us or, or, or mentioning to us in the market that they're looking for increased amenity, uh, whether it be just coffee or whether it be food and beverage as well, but if they need amenity within the foyer of their building. It's a convenience factor and they prefer to, to go downstairs to have a meeting, um, to have a really casual catch up with a client, um, but to actually have this amenity within the building is a really important part um, not only for the asset, but to keep your office tenants happy as well. It's important that we're not only catering to our office user upstairs, um, but also uh, foot traffic that is walking past that are potential paying customers for these retail operators. If able, what you need to do is consider relocating your non-retail specific services to the back of your ground floor. Um, it's really important that we are um, creating or giving the best of the NLA to our retail operators, um, which of course is at the front of the building. The more NLA that we can create, creates more space for retailers and in turn, higher revenue for you. The increase in retail amenity within the building will also increase uh, dwell times and the likelihood that they will purchase or purchase more within that time that they're, they're spending there. People will go down and they'll have business meetings in uh, the, the seating area. Um, and these increased dwell times will of course in turn uh, create higher revenue for those retail operators. It's really important that there is an equal amount of retail to uh, lounge or meeting space. Um, if you've got too much meeting space in your foyer, um, you need to reconsider uh, reducing the space um, and perhaps reallocating that space to a retailer or an F&B quick service retailer that can add amenity to your building. It's important to consider bringing your ground floor retail out to the sight line of the property. This will increase your NLA, create alfresco dining and attract established national food and beverage retailers. Consider glass shop fronts and a glass awning so as not to obstruct sight lines through to the building foyer itself. This helps to attract new customers who wouldn't usually visit the building. If you would like to discuss a personalised repositioning strategy for your CBD asset, get in touch with me now and book a time for me to inspect your space. If you have any questions that you would like me to answer in future videos, please leave them in the comment section below.